Hi, I'm about to play Monday Morning, a hit for Fleetwood Mac back in 1975. Before I start playing, I just, just for your information, I want to let you know that there is an instrumental section of that song where Lindsey Buckingham does a little solo. When I'm playing through the song, I'm just going to sort of hum through it as a, play, as a placeholder. But when we're done, when I go through the tutorial and I'm showing you the chords and the strum patterns, for those of you who like to play leads, I'll show you a lead I come up, I come up with that's uh, pretty faithful to Lindsey Buckingham's on the guitar. So we'll, we'll get to that um, after I play it. Here we go, Monday morning. Monday morning, you show Okay, so that was Monday Morning. Big hit for Fleetwood Mac back in 1975 when they came out with that breakthrough album with the new lineup. It was the first, uh, first album with Lindsey Buckingham and Stevie Nicks on it, and the album became a huge hit. And then the next one, Rumors, was even bigger. Um, and again, and by the way, and I played that song straight off the chord charts of the Marstown Uke Jam. So check out that video link. Download the free ukulele chord chart in the song sheet, and you can play along with this song. And if you're going to be in Marstown, New Jersey, on the first Wednesday of the month, come on out and join us at the Uke Jam. We'd love to see you there. So, okay, now that I've played through Monday morning, we're going to take a look at the chords, and that's going to be a very short part of this this tutorial because uh, untypically for a Fleetwood Mac song, there's only three, three chords in this entire song. So we'll go through those very quickly. I'll show you the, the kind of strumming I was doing on it. I'll try to de describe the, um, the strum pattern that I used there. And then as I said at the outset, for those of you who like to do little leads, I'll show you the, I'll show you the little lead that I came up with um, for that instrumental part of the song. So let's very quickly go through the chords. 
The first chord that shows up here is G. I don't think too many of you need to be introduced to G. Zero, two, three, two. The second chord that appears is C. Probably the first chord you guys learned on ukulele. Zero, 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 three. And the other chord that appears here is D. Two, 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 zero. And that's it for this entire song. That's the only three chords that appear in Monday morning. So with that out of the way, let's talk a little bit about the, the strum pattern that I use. And um, um, let me play the first couple lines and then we'll go back and talk about what I did here. Monday morning you show the fun. Friday I got traveling on my mind. When I was analyzing my own strum patterns here, what, what I thought of, what I heard myself doing was one and one, two, three, five. One, two, three, one, two, three, four, five. One, two, three, one, two, three, four, five. One, two, three, one, two, three, four, five. That was the basic rhythm, the pattern that I heard myself doing. One, two, three, one, two, three, four, Course, the only time that breaks is at the end of uh, most of those lines there's a quick C G. So one day morning you show the fun. Two quick downstrokes for that C, that C and G, but otherwise it's one, two, three, one, two, three, four, five. One, two, three, one, two, three, four, five. So if that works for you again i think most of you will find your own rhythm and i'll try to show you how i worked it in terms of down strokes and up strokes but again and i always say this in these videos don't get too hung up on how i did it there's lots of different ways to get that like right there i just did That's just the way I did it. Let me do that again. Down, up, down, down, up, up, down, down. That works for me. Again, don't get too hung up on it. Play through the song yourself. I think most of you probably know this song. You'll probably feel your own rhythm on that. And whatever works for you will be just fine. No one's counting your upstrokes and your downstrokes when you're playing the song. So that's really, again, it's a fairly simple song, especially by Fleetwood Mac standards. Three chords and a fairly simple strum pattern. Now, as I said at the outset, for those of you who like to do leads, I'm going to show you a lead that works in that, in that instrumental area. So let, let me play it through. So let me take you through that again, for those of you who, I start out by hitting, this is the 10th fret of the first string. Then I go, watch that. One, you just hit the, hit the string ones, and you get the, it's called a hammer on. Then you hit that note again. See that little slide from the eighth fret up to the ninth? Watch 
watch again. That's the ninth fret. Now I'm on the second string. And again, you hit the string once, hit it again, you get two notes again. So it's a. Then. Ninth fret on the third string, seventh fret on the ninth string, and then. So that's the first part of the solo. Then, watch this now, the second part. There's that hitting the string once and getting two notes again. Watch that again. Hammer on from the fifth to the seventh, hit, hit the fifth, fret of that string, then the eighth fret of the second string. Let me do that one more. Oh, so I'm Watch this very slowly now. Here you get three notes for one pluck. Watch that. See that? So you don't have to hit the string three times. You don't do. You just go. And then it goes to move down to the second string. Watch this again. There's that hammer on. There's those three notes for the price of one again. Then it goes back to what we did a few bars earlier. Same as we did before. And then Watch how it ends. You slide up to that ninth fret. Slide up to the ninth fret, first ring. Twelfth fret. Back to the ninth, and then go down to the second string. Twelfth fret, tenth fret. So let, let me do the whole solo slowly again. I did that sloppily. Let me do it again. Let me go there. So again, that's that's just if, if for those of you who want to fill in that instrumental, the you know the chord uh, progression during that is, and again you'll see this on the chord chart there. Let me find that for you. It's G. I'm sorry, G. C G. to the vocals but you know it's true so that's monday morning from fleetwood mac so i hope you enjoy playing it and those of you who like to do leads hope this gave you a little bit of guidance toward uh, coming up with a little lead that fits that chord progression